beautiful here. I haven't been to Miami in like I think over a decade. Last time I was here was in 2013 for Art Basel so yeah that's pretty crazy. That was like forever ago. So it's like lunchtime here now and I think I'm just gonna go shopping, maybe go to the beach. really want to go to the Versace mansion. I think it's a restaurant now. Yeah I've always wanted to go there. Basically I'm in Miami for a bachelorette party but I'm probably not gonna film that just because um I don't know. I feel weird filming people when I not sure if they're like really into that. I don't mind filming like when I'm out and stuff and if there's people that happens to be in the background, but if it's like friends or friends of friends, I just feel weird. I don't know. So <laughs> I think I'll probably film the rest of today and then all of tomorrow and then the day after is when I go to stay with all of them. So that's kind of what's happening. Um, but yeah, I'm like really parched right now. I didn't really, really drink anything. The flight was only 30 minutes. Yeah, there wasn't any like drinks that I forgot about that. So yeah, let's go get some lunch. back and I got some cute little swimsuits from everything but water and kind of took forever just because swimsuits are so difficult for me to find because I have such a confusing size like the top is smaller the bottom is bigger but then I also have a bigger bust so it can be really irritating shopping for swimwear I'll show you guys what I got I don't think I'm gonna try them on just because I'm not ready for that. It just seems like a little too much for me right now. This one is from Vitamin A and I think it's so cute how there's like this little tie in the middle and then this like kind of goes up high and then it has, um, does it have ties on the side? Cute little ties right here. It has like padding and stuff and then you can tie like this closer together. Usually halter tops hurt so bad. Like I never get swimwear that like ties at the top like this it like hurts like it's like you it lifts all the weight and then your neck gets really sore and it's like an awful feeling um but for some weird reason this didn't do that that much so hopefully that works out well and then i haven't gotten a bikini in a really long time so this is what the top looks like and i kind of like it because it's kind of cottagecore vibes and it kind of reminds me of rose from the titanic i don't ask me why i have no idea it's just but you know what i mean like it's kind of just that really happy about that and these are the bottoms they're so cute i just love the little like details right here like this little frill thing and then the bows like the tie on the side and then i really like this thing right here i think that makes the booty look so good i like that it's cheeky too not really a thong but like almost and i love that too because i like to get sun on my bum i'm happy that i got these um but yeah i'm gonna go get a drink
Okay, so I just got back from the Versace mansion and it was so fun, but I'm a little drunk. I had two cocktails, but they were so strong and I never drink on my own. Um, but this is my cute bikini I'm gonna wear to the beach, I think. Okay, this is so cute. I really love this bikini so much. I'll show you the details. I love how it makes my cleavage. I think I could like squish it more together. Um, but I love this. And then I love these little ties right here. I think that's so cute. And then the booty. I like how light colored it is. It's kind of giving like Wild Fox um, in like 2009 maybe. Like with the light vintage looking colors and then like the like dark eyes even though I don't have that. I'm gonna go shower because I'm really gross. I think I'm gonna go to South Beach and South Beach. I think I'm gonna go to South Beach and I'll probably go to Lauderay. I might get my friend macaroons just because I love macaroons so much. So hopefully she does too. And yeah, I don't really know where else I'm gonna go, but I'm just gonna walk around, I think. <laughs> restaurant and my uber driver she was just like oh my god how do you know that place like only the locals go there so i was like cool i guess i found a good place and she also recommended me to other really good restaurants and i'll put those up on the screen because i can't remember what they're called but one of them is this like really good mediterranean place and she said she goes there like three times a week or something okay also out of curiosity i i hate dating apps by the way i like don't like I deleted them in New York altogether because they fucking suck like they suck I've met some of the worst people on them but I was just curious here so I downloaded it and um I don't know I guess I can like we can go through the responses of what or not responses but just like messages guys have sent me this one guy he told me that I should just go back to New York City <laughs> yeah I should um Okay, so I just like X out the ones that don't say anything because I'm just like, why would I go out with you if you didn't like say something? Ooh, this guy's really cute. Red rose emoji. Ooh, he's really cute. But I don't know, I'm scared. I'm really scared of dating apps. Like, I, don't, I just like, I can't do it. I looked thinking it would be fun to go out with someone like, you know, see Miami a different way. But now I'm scared. <laughs> kind of looks douchey, but so does like everyone i've seen on here i mean i'm not going out like i'm gonna do my face mask i don't like i don't know why i'm even entertaining this no I, I just have to get rid of it yeah i don't know i can't do this right now i'll probably make another vlog about dating apps because i just i have a lot to say that's pretty much it <laughs> thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you in my next video